from rolling thunder to rolling with the tide. I love to compete. Like, I love to fight. I love to fight for the position. I don't want nothing given to me. Lehigh Senior High's Richard Young is ESPN's number one ranked running back in the country for the class of 2023. And he's going to play for one of college football's powerhouses, the Alabama Crimson Tide, after playing all four years on Lehigh's varsity football team. Man, I feel good just being a member of Alabama, man, just representing the city, man, um, ready to get up there, ready to work, and ready to uh, play against the best. Young's electric burst of speed is one thing you need to see to believe. Just look at how fast he goes from his first step. He can also make defenders miss with some jukes, power his way through them, or jump over them. It's in this game that our freshmen in high school don't know a world with Southwest Florida teams being on national TV for the first time ever. Lehigh High School hosts a game. This past season, you may have seen him show off his lightning speed on ESPNU against Lake Gibson. Plays both ways in the backfield with him. He's leading the way on second and five. Showing off the speed, hitting the sideline. Richard Young with his first big play of the night, and he is gone! Into the end zone for a touchdown! 90 big ones for Young! That 90-yard touchdown run was a part of a 285-yard performance on national television which was a career high for him. According to Max Preps, Richard ran for at least 1,000 yards for two seasons in a row, and he was close to that mark in his sophomore year. His highest rushing total was more than 1,700 yards in his junior season. He also scored 42 touchdowns in his career, with 19 in that junior season. And those numbers earned him the 2021 Southwest Florida Offensive Player of the Year from the news press. This is an example from last year of how bad some of the top programs wanted Richard on their team. Two-time national champion Georgia Bulldogs coach Kirby Smart flew into Lehigh by helicopter to meet with Richard's coaches to talk about him. Florida Gators coach Billy Napier showed up right after Smart. Then another two-time national champion coach, Clemson's Dabo Sweeney, walked through the front door. Other coaches that visited included Ohio State coach Ryan Day, and Alabama coach Nick Saban, both posing with now former head coach James Chaney. And Richard was loving every second. <laughs> he visited many schools, including the schools whose coaches visited Lehigh. But he knew where his heart was after a visit to Tuscaloosa, Alabama, and Coach Saban. They made me work out. I already had the offer, but they made me, they wanted to see like my abilities and all like I'm legit. He was like impressed with everything. He, he knew it was gonna be a different breed coming out that backfield when I get there. So just talking to him for the first time, it was amazing. Cause after the second time I committed, I signed a committee. I was like, yep, it's here, it's home. He signed his letter of intent to play for Alabama in December of 2022. It was a lot of pressure, a lot of stress, a lot of, um, ups and downs, but my, my family and my coaches, they helped me uh, through this process and they helped me to stay, keep my head up and um, don't lose focus. Well, I, I think um, my job was pretty much, you know, to, to treat him normal. Um, you know, he came in with a lot of lights and um, he's a hard worker. You know, he pretty much, you know, did everything we asked him to do. Coach Anthony Dixon was the offensive coordinator for Lehigh. Over his career, he's coached players that made it to the NFL, including Super Bowl champion wide receiver Sammy Watkins and current Dallas Cowboys safety J. Ron Curse. But Coach Dixon told me about what makes Richard stand out the most. What people probably don't know is that um, he really do care a lot about others. You know, um, you know, situations in the game. You know, where you know we had a younger running back and he's you know letting go in the game and. Um, and you know, a couple of times, you know, I like, hey, what, what are you doing out, whatever. But you know, he just, he cares so much about everybody else. Time will tell when we see Richard on the field in Tuscaloosa, but he hopes to take what he learned from Lehigh and take his game to the next level. Everything 100%. My biggest lesson, like, with just in general, with school, make sure everything you're on top of your work, everything is 1% better. So that's what my coach and my family told me I gotta do every day. I'm Adam Hodjost with Lee Schools TV.